Hi everybody and welcome back to some more Dirt 4 here on this channel. I'm KPG Guna here. Now in today's episode we're going to take on some Rallycross in the RX Super 1600 Cup. Now, uh, I haven't done any Rallycross on this game yet, so I'm really, really excited for this. And, uh, yes, yeah, so we're going to do uh, this uh, tournament. I think there's three different rounds of two races, a semi-final and a final. And, uh, yeah, I'm really, really loving this game at the moment. So let's get straight in to do some Rallycross and see what it's like. So here we go. Right guys, first up we're in Portugal for the first two Rallycross races. Now the only Rallycross circuits I can remember from Dirt Rally were Lidden Hill and I think the Sweden circuit, was it Hell or something? They were really, really good fun so I'm hoping this is going to be uh, pretty good as well. So we're in the Renault Clio uh, 1600 RS and uh, let's just see how it goes. Um, obviously I haven't uh, got one of these cars myself so I'm unable to upgrade it but uh, we will get one of our own hopefully after this and yeah, I'm really enjoying this game so let's get straight into the first race and see if we can get a victory right so here we go with the first race in portugal and also guys i am using the steering wheel i'm using a frostmaster t300 rs and i'm on simulation so i keep getting loads of uh, comments asking me what settings i'm on and what i'm using and uh, let's see if we can get a good start here also i'm going to mix up the camera views in each race so let's see if we can get a good start now it's all about tactics with those joker laps i think i might go on the joker first is anyone going down oh god i just made contact with that car there and let's go on our joker oh god lost the back end oh god they do slide into the turns so i'm going to have to use the handbrake really well with these cars as well and and that's a, a bit of a bad start actually we've lost a bit of distance on the other cars but i thought going on the joker first as i was down that side it might work out that way let's try and get tight into that turn oh god that handbrake skid didn't work and we are just behind but i'm the only one that's jokered so far so it might work out okay now three of the other cars have gone for their joker right we've got to get ahead of them oh god just lost the back end and that car's going to come out in front of us and we need to get ahead of him so because he's jokered so we're we've got to get ahead of every car that's jokered in front and the other two leading the race haven't oh he lost it there so i've managed to get past him he totally lost the back end it's nice to see the uh, the AI uh, losing control of the cars as well because these things are difficult to get around this circuit right let's try and get up the inside here try and hold a tight line another car's gone on a joker and I've just lost it there but that car still hasn't jokered so hopefully if he goes on the joker on the last lap and I can just get past him here then we've got a good chance of winning this first semi-final right just hold it here and give a nice handbrake skid oh that was much better there loads of wheel spin probably gonna have no tyres left at the end of this race right last lap and it looks like we're going to win this semi-final and we're going to get to the final just losing it slightly in that turn but these cars are so much fun i cannot wait to get to the more powerful cars on some of the other variations now i think all these uh ones in today's rally cross are the shorter version oh god just lost the got a little bit too tight into there but that doesn't matter we've managed to get first place in the semi-final and now we move on to the final but that first experience oh it's amazing guys but we are going to change up the view in the next race so let's get straight into it right so we move on to the final and that was really really good fun also guys i am going to move it up to the hardest difficulty after this championship i've had loads of messages uh, just saying just go to the hardest level and whether you struggle or not it's best way to improve so after this championship guys we're going to move up to the hardest difficulty because we're only the one below and uh, we're going to do the rest of the career series on the hardest level right let's move to the final and see if we can get a win overall this is going to be awesome let's get straight into it right guys so here we are in the final and we start at the front this time if we can get a good start here that would be awesome and uh, it's six laps this time so let's see if we can get a good start and we're gonna go in cockpit view as well and green off we go loads of wheel spin and that's all got a bit of contact from behind already Bloody hell, they don't hold back in these uh, rally cross races. And let's just try and get an inside line here. I can't go on my joker because I was too tight in there and I, it was not worth it. And I just lost it in that corner. I just lost the position. Let's just try and fight back past him. No, he totally blocked me off. He can't obviously see in his rear mirror with all that dirt over the back. Oh, God, he, he slammed the brakes on a bit early there. And I just made contact. I'm going to put a lot of damage on this car in this final. And we're probably going to have to spend some credits on it. But who cares as long as we get the win. Right, let's just try and go 
on our joker. Right, let's just dive down the inside. Can we get a good speed through here? Trying to hold it around the corner. And actually, it feels a little bit better in cockpit view. Uh, I feel like uh, it's a little bit more realistic as well. But like I said, I get loads of messages asking me to change up the views. So I thought I'd just keep flipping through different views each race. Oh, God, someone's lost a bit of their car there. And we get into that corner. And we're only in fourth Second onto place. the third lap. We need to push and try and get closer to the front. Looking at to the jokers, there's still two that haven't jokered. I'm not sure. Oh, they're the two in the lead. Oh, God. Sideswipe that car there. But he managed to hold his position. And I still haven't gained any more. Then we're on the third lap. We need to push. Oh, God. Just caught the curb there. And the back end of the car in front is all over the place. Let's see if we can get past him here. Is he going to go a little bit wider? I've had to slow down. And he's managed to get away a little bit quicker. We really lost it in that corner. And we got a little bit of contact from behind. We're getting really pressured here. Right. That car's going on its joker lap now. So, no, he isn't actually. He's going to leave it probably to the last couple of laps. Just trying to go on the inside. We managed to muck him in the corner. Take that. Uh, that gets you back for that a previous lap. Right. We managed to get straight into second place. Right behind a car that hasn't jokered. This could work out perfectly. Right. Let's just get right into that corner. Ex accelerate. Now he's got a joker. And oh, is he going to go on his last lap? Is he going to go another lap? I don't know. Is he going to go? Yes, no, he's going on. He's going to go on his last lap. If we can get past him here, and he's got a joker, and that's going to put us in a good position. So we go into the lead. The car behind still has the joker, and it puts us in a great spot to get the victory in this first championship in the rally cross. Oh, God, just lost it in that turn slightly. Loads of wheel spin, and that car's got back past me. But you've got a joker, son, so you're in trouble, and I should be okay from here. Right, let's just try and get nice and tight into this turn. Try not to make any mistakes. And we should be home and dry for a victory in this first championship. And it looks like we are. As long as we don't cock it up in this last turn, we should be okay. But this short version is really, really good fun. Definitely like this one. Right, into that turn. No to wheel spin over the finish line. And we take a victory in the first championship on the rally cross yes. in the 1600s. Right. And that was absolutely win. superb. I really, really enjoyed that. But I think we do need to up the level, guys, to give us a bit more of a challenge. Right, let's get into the next championship. Right, so we take 25 points in the first championship. And uh, like I said, guys, I am going to up the level in the next championship. I haven't decided what I'm going to do next. We might get back to some rallying in the next episode. Let me know which rally courses you want me to try. There's loads. We've got Spain. There's absolutely loads to try in this in this series. So we might get back on it. We need to buy a car as well. Let me know what sort of cars and what uh, categories you want me to try because we have opened quite a few as well. Uh, just let me know in the comments below and we will get back into the rally on the harder level as well. Right, let's get into the next championship. I think next one's in Sweden. So let's get straight into it. Right, I'm not sure whether I've done this one. Uh, I did, like I said, do a couple of circuits on the rally cross on Dirt Rally, but I'm not sure whether it was this variation. But we're going to jump straight into it. And also, guys, I'm going to be doing some rally cross online. So if you've got this game, friends request me because I will be doing a live stream with some rally cross events because I think it's so exciting and so much fun. It's going to be epic. So if you want to join in with that, let me know in the comments below. Right, let's get into this race and see if we can get another decent result. So here we go. Right, so here we go with this first race in Sweden. Let's see if we can get into the final. So we need to finish in the top three. And uh, like I said, we're going to keep changing up the views. So let's see if we can get a good start. So we start from the back in the semi-final. And let's see if we can get a good start. And off we go. Loads of wheel spin on that gravelly section. Let's just go down here. I've just got to remember this circuit. Oh, God. Went straight into the back of the other Clio there. And I've just got shunted as well. So there's quite a bit of damage to the car already. Thank you very much for that. You're costing me uh, credits. Right, let's just try and get a nice turn in here. I think I remember this one. I think this is a shorter version as well. I don't think I've done this particular one, uh, this version, but definitely uh, remember this circuit. Right, that's uh, us up to third place. And uh, the, no one's... Oh, no, no one's jokered yet, so no one's jokered yet. I think it's all going to be very tactical in this first race. Let's just try and keep up the cars in front. We're actually losing a bit of ground on them, actually. Let's just go through and joker now. Let's try and get a nice turn through there. That wasn't too bad. Have I lost the place? No, I haven't lost the place. So I'm still sitting in third. Oh, God, almost went straight into that barrier there, but just managed to turn away. That's a difficult section there. Loads of wheels spin around that corner, and we've just lost ground. Now, it looks like everyone's already jokered, so... Uh, we've got a couple of laps to maybe get past these two, uh, or at least a finish in this position. Oh, God, just lost it in that uh, corner and hit a couple of poles sitting in, sitting in the ground there. 
And let's just try and hold it through here a little bit quicker. Oh, lost traction again. Oh, my God. Almost went straight up. Barry. Oh, God, that is a difficult section. We go up on two wheels, and then you just totally lose control. And that's the difficulty with these rally cross. To get around the corner sometimes, as soon as you, your car goes up on two wheels, you're screwed, really, sometimes. Right, let's just try and hold it around here. Again, lost the back end. And really struggling to keep up with these two in front. It looks like I'm not going to win this semi-final. But as long as I stay in this position, and that car's just lost a bit of its, uh, its bodywork there. And again, just lost it in that turn, but just managed to correct myself. And it looks like we're going to take third place. But at least we're in the final. But I can see this final being a lot more difficult than the uh, last championship. Uh, so we're going to have to up our game. That was a little bit harder. So let's get straight into the uh, final now, guys. So here we go. Right guys, uh, so we make the final, but we're definitely going to have to up our level. We really struggled in that one. I just couldn't uh, get the hang of that section where it just uh, it just went up the hill to the right. So I kept on almost going into that left-hand barrier. So we're definitely going to have to be quicker through there. And uh, yeah, so let's just quickly repair our vehicle. We had a slight damage, nothing major. And uh, yeah, that's not going to cost much. And let's get straight into this. And we're just going to have to try and push. Hopefully we start up from the front this time. And also I'm going to change up the view as well again. So let's just get straight into this final and see what happens. So here we go. Right, guys, so we're, we're starting from the back again, and we're going to go in bonnet cam this time, uh, just to change it up, like I said, and let's see if we can get a good start here. And I think we need to be a little bit more tactical with our joker. We went really early uh, with the other cars, and we just couldn't get past them. Right, let's just try and just get past a few cars in this first quarter. And the Volkswagen Polos have got away already. Uh, they were the two that were just quickest in that first uh, uh, semi-final. Right, let's just try and stick with them and try and get a better line through here. We struggled through here in the last uh, uh, semi-final. So let's see if we can be better through here and just keep up the pace. Right, let's just try and get up the inside and take third position. Can we get past? Yes, we managed to get past. Let's see if we can slow it down and get a better line through here and just keep up with these two. Hopefully, hopefully they go on their joker and we can get past them. Oh God, that car must lost his back and he's gone on his joker, but the other car, the Polo, has not gone on his joker. Right, let's just go up behind him and see if we can pressure him into some mistakes. Right, let's just try and get nice and tight into that corner, just losing the back end slightly. And we just need to push a little bit more and get a little bit closer to him. Because even if the uh, Jokers, if he gets there pretty quick, we're still going to struggle to get past him. So let's just try and stick with him. God, he lost the rear end there. And, he had to, and again, he lost it in there. So he's definitely uh, struggling through there. Let's just try and keep with him. And he's not joking just yet. So he's he's obviously waiting for the right time. Let's see if we can get past him in this turn. No, he's blocked me off there. He's been really, really tactical. Let's just see if we can sit behind him and just try and get past him. And we should be able to get past him here if we can get a good run down the hill and just try and hug that inside line and we should take first position and we are into first place but I still reckon we should go another lap before Jokerin so let's just go another lap into the fifth lap and maybe if we've got a bit of distance between us and the car behind then maybe we should Joker but we're both uh, first and second haven't jokered yet so it's just down to tactics now is he going to go on his uh, on this lap or is he going to leave it to the last lap but uh, I've just got to be clever here if I go too early and he gets a bit of a lead and he leaves it to the final lap it might screw me over so let's just see if we've got a decent uh, gap there yeah I think we have so let's just go and I'll joker and see if we can come out in front of him no he didn't he got in front but he didn't joker himself so we might still have a chance of getting past him as long as we can get a little bit closer. I was hoping to uh, get a little bit further away from him then. I thought he was a little bit further away. I should have checked, but there you go. You make little sillier errors. Right, let's just try and run it down the hill, get a little bit closer. Now he has the joker now. And we just hit some poles there. That's going to slow us down. And we lost it in that corner. He's going to come through his joker. Let's just try and run it through there. And we've got out in front of him. Just hold it in that corner. And it looks like we're going to win the final here. What a super super tactic there we left it until the fifth lap and it worked out to be brilliant for us and we take victory there you go we take another victory and luckily it worked out for us because that could have gone horribly wrong so let's get into the results 
So we get another victory in the second Rallycross Championship and that was awesome. That worked out for me with my tactics with the Joker. Now we move on to England, Lydon Hill. Now that's one that I do remember and that's an awesome circuit. It's probably going to be the shorter version because they seem to be on the shorter version on this championship. But uh, yeah, we would have got a reward. We do need to up the level. It looks like it's saying we would have got some credits if we had had it on the higher level. So we're definitely going to up that level as well for the next championship. And I think we do need to up the difficulty and it hopefully improve, make us improve because it will push you that little bit more. But I can't, once you start a tournament, you can't change the difficulty. So let's move on to Lydon Hill and let's see how difficult that's going to be. Uh, but I'm looking forward to it. It is an awesome rallycross circuit. And uh, I, I been, I've actually been to Lydon Hill and it is fantastic and i'll tell you what most of these games do uh, give a good representation of the circuit it does look absolutely brilliant on this game so well done for that uh code masters right so that's a move on into this championship try and get to the final uh and hopefully win the final but i think this one's going to be the hardest one of the lot because i think out of all three circuits it is the most difficult it's got the hardest joker i know that for definite so let's get straight into it now guys and see if we can get on that uh, podium with another win so let's get straight into the semi-finals so here we go use the joker lap to your advantage you only need to take it once if you miss it you'll get a time penalty all right, good luck today. Give it your best. Right, guys, so here we go with the semi-final around Lydon Hill. I'm so looking forward to this one. Now, we're going to change up the views again. And we're sitting right on the left. So, should we joker on the first lap? It might be a plan, but we will see what the other cars do. If they all joker, then I might just go round. No, they're all going round. So, let's go for the joker. Now, this is one of the most difficult jokers out of the three championships for definite. It's really hard to get round there quick. And that wasn't too bad. It wasn't as fast as I could do it but we've got it out of the way and let's see if it works out for us in this semi-final let's see if we can catch up oh god I just lost the back end there oh god that could have been really bad I thought it almost went all the way round and now I can see a car going through his joker is he going to come out before I get round there yes he does so we're miles oh god we've lost a lot of lot of uh, distance with the cars the other cars now since so sometimes if you go on your joke in that first lap it is an absolute nightmare and it looks like we've absolutely ruined our chances of winning this one unless we can react now that car's gone for his joker and the car in front's the one that we need to get in front of to get in that top three uh, we're sitting in second at the moment uh, everyone's oh everyone's joking now so we're, we're sitting in second so that's not bad let's just see if we can just catch up we've only got one more lap and I've just lost the back end there again that is a difficult turn round there the, the, this red player doesn't seem to like that uh, I was going to uh, handbrake it but you're just losing the back end round there anyway right you want to get your wheels on that uh, tarmac there to get a little bit more grip round that corner and let's see if we can get to the end and it looks like we're going to come second in the semi-final right let's just be a a little bit careful around that turn again losing the back end and over the finish line so it looks like we take second but at least we're in the semi-final but that is a lot harder it's going to be that. down to some real good tactics to win the final i think let's get straight into it right guys so we got second in the semi-final now we move on to the final this is where things get difficult that is a much uh, more challenging circuit uh, for the rally cross uh, so this is going to be tough so we're going to have to be really tactical i don't think going on our joker on the first lap will work uh, we will see depends what position we start on the grid and obviously we're going to change up the views as well let's just get straight into it hopefully we can win but i think it's going to be a lot harder so let's get straight into it now so here we go right guys so here we go with the final now do we go on our joker because we're sitting on the left again i'm just going to wait to see what the other cars do before i decide and we're going in cockpit view for the final let's see if we can get a good start here and see if that yellow car in front goes down in the joker if he does uh i might not go down there but if he doesn't 
Uh, I might go first. Oh, he does it. Oh, but the blue one went down there. Oh, bloody hell, he came from nowhere. Right, that's to see if we can get through this joke. We slow down there. Can we get past him? We're going side by side through the joker. That's slowing us both down, but we're fighting for the position. And I managed to get through there before him. And we're into fifth position. Now we just need to chase down the leaders. It's six laps in this race. And we need to be better around this corner as well. Let's just try and hold the position as the car behind it has jokered. So we want to stay in this position onto the grass there. Just loosen it uh, slightly. Right, let's see what the other cars do. No other car is joking. Oh, I've gone right into the barrier. Totally lost it there. So difficult to go fast through there. But we managed to hold the lead with the, from the car behind. And we're starting to gain on some of the other cars. We've just got to keep our eyes open to see where the cars go. There's two that have gone down for the Joker. We need to come out in front of them too so we don't lose the position. Right, let's just get through here. Can we get past before they come out? Yes, we managed to get past. And we've taken a couple more places. So we're up to third place. But the two cars in front still haven't jokered and we're on the third lap coming into the fourth lap and uh, we're just going to have to see when they go for their joker one of them's gone down there right again we've got to go through there nice and quick and get in front of that car to make sure we hold that position we get through there nice and uh, yes we managed to get through there and we're into second place now it's all down to the car in front he has got a bit of a distance in front and it's going to be a little bit harder to get to closer to him is he going to joker on this lap it's still only the fourth lap yes i think he's going for it yes he's gone for his joker We've got to come out in front of him here. Right, let's just try and hold it around this turn. Is he going to come out? And we've managed to come out in front of him. So we're into the lead. Oh, my God. We've just got to hold it for a little bit longer. And we're going to take a victory in this final. I thought that that car was going to come out in front. I thought he had a little bit more distance on him. And he didn't really. And we managed to get through there. Now it's the last lap. And sometimes I don't make any mistakes. We are going to win this final around Linton Hill. Again, we've gone around there a little bit smoother. Got our wheels on the tarmac. And we're going to hold it. Oh, this is brilliant. It looks like we are going to take a victory. And what a performance in this championship. But I definitely think in the next episode, we're going on to the hardest difficulty to up that challenge. But that was a brilliant experience. I hope you enjoyed it. Right, let's get straight into the results, guys. So here we go. What a fantastic championship. So we managed to take another victory and we won every every final. We didn't win every round. A couple of the semi-finals we struggled. Just learning the circuit that was base based on really but uh, yeah that was really really good fun but i definitely think we need to up up the difficulty so we're going to go on the toughest difficulty in the next championship if we do another rally cross and obviously in the other uh, tournaments as well we'll be on the hardest difficulty but we get loads of credits for that do we get do we actually get a reward on the last championship i got a bit yes we get another vehicle so we get the an rx2 ford fiesta uh, that looks absolutely awesome as well. So I'm going to leave you two replays, guys, also of the two of those championship races at the end of this video. I hope you enjoy it. Please, please give this video a big thumbs up. I'm really enjoying this game. I hope you're enjoying the series. There's going to be plenty more coming from this game on this channel. So I hope you join in, not just from the series, but the online as well. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and I will see you very, very soon.